Hey everybody, welcome to the new digs over here in the greenhouse. Uh, this is the office that Justin and I share and most of our staff is over here. Come by and see us anytime during office hours. Uh, I want to invite you to invite someone to come to church with you this Sunday. I think the scripture about King David in 2 Samuel is amazing because it shows the humanity. Uh, we're going to look at the, the sin of David with Bathsheba in 2 Samuel uh, chapter 11. We're just going to read verses 1 through 15, but please read that in preparation because I want us to think about how one sin leads to another. And this is where the rubber meets the road for those of us who are Christian, uh, for how we live our faith to be holy, to live holy lives. It doesn't mean we're perfect. None of us are. But we're going to look at David's life and see how one sin leads to another and sort of take inventory in our lives if, if we are at places that we need to um, slow our roll sinfully a little bit. I think most of us do. And seek the greater good of God's grace and God's will in our lives. Please read 2 Samuel chapter 11, verses 1 through 15. Uh, pray for our church and pray for God to do something amazing during our worship. We have three morning services, two at 845, one at 11, and then an evening service at 6 p.m. in the chapel. And this week, our evening service will be a healing service. So uh, please pray for God to do amazing things through our church because God is and let's be a part of that and consider how one sin leads to another. Love you. Mean it. Bye.